Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of No Man's Sky. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault here today. Hope you enjoy the video. We got one for you today. We're going to work on our freighter a little bit, but first we're going to go explore a derelict freighter in this system where I set up a base solely to gather activated indium. So, without further ado, let's roll the music and we're going to get right to it. So, yeah, this is all cob jobbed up here. These are going to go away. I had to do that temporarily just to make room in my inventory. Uh, we're going to hit up a freighter. We're going to want to clean out some space. So, I was pretty much packed to the gills. I was running around uh, pirate system doing some pirate stuff. Uh, I got some salvage frigate modules from there, and I was like, you know, I got enough um, probably to get almost everything for a... Uh, to start working on the freighter. Why not do one more freighter mission? We'll see what the one is like in this system, see if it's any good. Just to see the frigate, I should say. Just to see if it's uh, a good one, you know, where we get some S-Class stuff too, because that would be an added bonus. So we'll be mining activated indium. It's pretty good for money, still not as good as um, chlorine, but you know, it is what it is. All right, so let's go ahead and put some stuff on here. We'll just gonna make a lot of room. I don't like running out of space when I'm on these uh, the derelict freighters. It's just aggravating. It's, you know, it shouldn't happen. That's just poor planning, and I don't like to be accused of poor planning, which I poorly plan all the time. But in any case, that's probably why I don't like it. Let's see what this guy's all about. Hopefully, it's a good one. Hopefully, it's not a pain in the butt. But you know what they say, wish in one hand, crap in the other. Let's see which fills up first. Yes, I want to override the seal. Have aliens? Do we have robots? I don't know. Well, we got robots right off the bat. So that's probably a good sign, although I've been in ones I believe that have had both, so you know, there's that as well. And yeah, we'll prepare to get tons and tons of ammunition again. What I'm really hoping for is some salvage frigate modules, man. I want to be able to start working on my freighter. Hey, blueprint's good. That means it's one better. Oh, there's another. That's a better chance of getting a salvage frigate module next time. So yeah, the. Uh, Now what we're going to do is we're going to build the... What I hear? I hear you. Where are you? I hear a bad robot. We're going to work on like the deck area where we launch our missions and stuff like that to start with. Um, we're not going to do the industrial area. We're not going to do the growing area or anything like that. It's basically going to be... Um, the ability to fast travel, launch missions, that sort of thing. It's going to be a little hairy. But definitely not as bad, at least in my opinion, as the damn aliens. Being that we want salvage frigate modules, we're going to kind of take our time in this one. 
and gather as much crap as possible because this is a basically a loot run. We're not just speed running this to get to the end to see what's at the end. We're gonna try and get some salvage frigate modules. You know, sometimes you get two or three. Sometimes you get one. Sometimes you get none. Really, it's completely random. I'm getting a lot of blueprints this time, which is, like I said, fantastic. It sucks for salvage frigate modules, but they take up the same uh, spot in the loot pool that the uh, salvage frigate modules do. So every time I find one of them, and I found three so far, that gives me three more chances to find a module. Where are you? Right there. Uh-oh, we're doing that thing again. That's not cool. Now, I fixed it last time by exiting and re-entering the game, but... Let's try this. So I didn't try this last time. Alright, looks like that worked. So I don't have to like screw myself over this time. I hear ya. Come on. Who else wants some? I got it. I got plenty to go around, baby. Up oh, there is the salvage trigger module. I think we already have four. So these are just the icing on the cake. Uh, we're going to focus on building parts before anything else, and then we'll focus on all the warp drives and all the extra stuff. But for now, I want to make the crater a home. I've gotten used to that with my main character, being able to just bring him in and do anything and everything I want to do. Nowhere, man. So yeah, I do miss that. I miss not having that ability. It's a little, it's a little frustrating sometimes because it's like, oh, I'm so used to just, you know, let me summon in my freighter, let me pull this off of it, and pull that off of it, and do this, and nope. ourselves too. We're not really injured as much as we raised our health up with uh, the star seed and I believe the remembrance and we never did the full heal on it after we did. we did in the last room. We'll get the security credentials. I don't think we did the uh, machine in here, did we? Computer? Yeah. Let's go take care of this real quick. Aloy, huh? We got a little crossover going on with uh, Horizon Forbidden West, I think. Yeah, that was bad. Yeah, if we hadn't come back, we would have missed that hypnotic guy. Alright, let's warm up again.
so much ammunition. You're probably starting an ammo store after a couple of these runs. Bucks, we ought to recover something at least. All right, blah 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 blah. Just rush through all this crap. None of it matters. Unless you're the ultimate lore hound, and this game is not built for a lore hound. But you know, you do you. Tip it, blah 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 blah. Good lord. That's what I want. Hey, hey emergency heater. Is that four different sets of plans today, I think? And there's another module, that's fantastic. Speaking of heaters, <coughs> excuse me, let's see, real quick, did we miss anything, just a little briefcase here, alright, well we got a dead end here, so let's go check it out, see if we got any goodies in here, and this one's a real miss, sometimes you'll find four or five crates and briefcases in these things, but not today. That looks like it in here. Moving on, we got only a couple more areas to do. It's a pretty big one here. Oh. Knocked out, done. By a little flying jellyfish creature. Temperature levels stabilizing. Units received. Marble cores, doll cords, all the good stuff in this one. Painted metal, neural ducts. Should I'll make some money. Projectile. Ammo. So much ammo. I guarantee we'll be well into our uh, second stack by the time this is done. Look at this, and this is kind of interesting. You don't really see things like this very often with these little skinny hallways. That was kind of wild. Could have just easily missed that. There's another one off of it here. Leads back out. Oh, wow, and a whole hidden room. Huh. I'll be darn. All right, where to go? Why did I flip? There we go. Pretty big room here too. Tainted metal. Okay, not a lot, but hey, every little bit helps. This is gonna take me right back out. Yeah, to 
to where it was. Perfect. And the beauty of the heater. Alright, so that way we came from, I'm pretty sure. Wow, another one. Just imagine if all of those were salvage frigate units, which, you know, potentially they could have been. I'd be walking away with seven of them this time around. I do love it when they have ships stored in here. It's always kind of like a cool moment. Pull a module off of it. Is that where we came in? No, that's not where we came in from over... Well, now. What's over here? This is a really interesting setup on this one. It's... Definitely a little different than I'm used to. Alright, that's the way up to the last section. I thought there was a door over here, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I was wrong. Okay, I'll see in that window and just assuming. Okay. So yeah, this will bring us toward the end now. Probably the last room, or maybe the next to last. Yep, last room coming up. Alright, well. Last chance for another salvage frigate unit. Hopefully we'll grab one. If not overall, this was a pretty solid uh, run. I, I, it wasn't too bad as far as enemies go. If you don't have a good gun or a decent amount of health, you may have run into trouble here, but otherwise, you know, I'm pretty mediocre in those standings. I mean, my health's good, but I'm already three health down. You know, I forgot to go heal up first. But this should be a pretty easy one to beat, even at a fairly lower level. Just got to be careful. Especially in that one room where I think three of those robots hit me at once. That can get dicey real quick. You can end up taking uncomfortable amounts of damage. So, all right, time for the moment of truth. What are we getting from you, baby? Come on, big money, big money, S class. And it's a C class. C for crap. All right. Well, not a bust by any sense of the imagination because. Two salvage frigate modules, that's always a good deal. You can't go wrong with that, so happy with that. Um, otherwise, eh. Not sure if we made our five million back. Don't really care. I don't do that to make the money back. But it would be nice, right? Alright, let's find the space station. base, clean ourselves up, clean up our ship, and figure out what we're going to do next. It has been a good run. I think next uh, episode I'm going to start the Dreams of the Deep. I don't know if that's, uh, you know, we'll do that one with a lot of cuts like we did the uh, Under a Rebel Star one to hopefully make it one episode. 
if I remember correctly, that one runs a little longer than Under a Rebel Star, so... Not, but I'm not sure. It might not be that bad. And once we cut out all the traveling, I have a feeling it'll be roughly the same length, you know? A 30-minute video-ish. I don't mind going a little over or under for something like that, as long as it's uh, done. Let's go home. And once we're home, we're going to take all that counterfeit stuff, all the black market goods out, and just sell them at our house. Better not to fly with them if you can't avoid it. So if you get scanned by the authorities, well, then the sentinels will give you hell. Alright, so right here first. What can go into here? That can go, that can go. Those can go. This can go. Got these in there already? Yep. All of these are going to get traded in. Um, yeah, I guess we'll throw the extra projectiles in there. Let's see the value of this kind of stuff that we got, just out of curiosity. One million. Yeah, see, you don't really recover the five million unless things are incredible. Now, these can be sold for, I think it's tainted metal and something else, but I don't remember what the other thing is, so we won't even consider that. Now, we do get a decent amount of nanites, you know, 18, 20, 20, 320 of them, you know, nothing special. We get so much more refining them that that's not even really something I look forward to. You know, it's like, eh, whatever. Right, can we can we stop? Ever since the 4.0 update, it's a little clunkier moving stuff around. Alright, do this. I want to make sure I have enough room to take everything back off the ship. put in here. Yeah, so that gives us six overall, which is a decent amount. So in fact, next episode will be uh, building the freighter. The one after that, we will go ahead and do the Dreams of the Deep. So let's go ahead and get all this stuff back in our outfit here. Bing, bing. Take that for in. See how we're looking now? Yeah. Not so good. All right, well. Got lots of oxygen. Let's see if we have any more. Another 1,200? Hell yeah. Alright, we may as well get some oxygen cooking up with the, uh, the chlorine, because I do want to fill that box up and just get rid of all of it in one fell swoop. After that, yeah, maybe we can go on and do something else. We want to sell. Yeah, see, don't sell these. Give them to the guy on the uh, on the star or the space station. Much more value in that. Arrow ducks, eight hundred thousand, two hundred thousand. There's a million. Let's 
so we lost approximately four million on that one. And again, not the end of the world. Put those in there for the moment. That should actually be in here because Star Silk is not illegal. And it is a building component. Alright. So yeah, there's half a million. Another close to half, so around about a million. 1.5 A little over 2 Let's say 3 3 and a half Wow, there we go 5 point 5 and a quarter roughly Holy crap Well, that was definitely worth it. And this inventory all cleaned up, looking great. I forgot. Yeah, we did have some nanites cooking. We'll get some more real quick while that chlorine is being made. I think that leaves me with like four to five more stacks to fill up that box, and then we sell it all. up. All we really have to do now is go to the space station and turn in those modules for nanites and that'll clear up our inventory there. Um, yeah, we'll figure out. Um, yeah, next episode, like I said, we're going to bring in the freighter and get to work on that. So we should have plenty, plenty salvage frigate modules to uh, make it work so for now we're going to wrap up this episode of no man's sky as always captain beefy with the game vault if you enjoyed the video at all and i hope you did please leave a like on it don't forget to subscribe to the channel ring that bell for notifications new videos daily you never want to miss one i'll see you guys next time until then peace